and if you're going on a long road trip with a baby or a toddler, keep a good attitude about it. Bring your movies, bring your snacks, and it's gonna be okay, right? It's gonna be okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jess. I'm a Christian mommy to two little girls. One is down here, so hopefully she'll behave. Um, ages two years and nine months. Um, I do videos on mom tips like this one. I also do cleaning videos and day in the life videos. So if you'd like to, make sure to hit that subscribe button. But, 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 but. Yeah, you know what I mean. Um, anyway, I'm currently in the middle of packing, so if you can see that mess back there, um, yeah, that's why. I have like an hour before we have to be ready to go on a nine hour road trip and yeah I'm still packing so I really wanted to get this video um, filmed so I'm just gonna do it so hopefully we can get this done pretty quickly. Our closest family lives like nine hours away and then after that like the closest family is 16 hours away so we have done plenty of <laughs> road tripping. Did I say that I'm a mom to a two year old and a nine month old? I can't remember but I am so that's what I have stuff packed for. So I just wanted to show you what we have packed in our bag that's gonna stay in the car with us and have all the entertainment items. All right, so this is the bag that I am bringing. Um, it's not totally my favorite. I usually choose like not so bright colored bags, but that's okay, it was gifted to us and it does the job. And so this bag will just stay in the car and have all of our goodies in it for entertaining the children. And then I also have in here, um, like a divider thing. And I actually got this on Amazon, so I'll link it below in case you're interested. But it just makes it a lot easier. It's not just like one huge bag with stuff floating around. Um, it's actually organized. Okay, I have, oh, you know what? I just remembered, I forgot an item. I'll be back. Okay, so the first item is this iPad. Ooh, look, can you see yourself? There you are. Is an iPad, and I have already gone on here on Netflix and on Prime Video and I downloaded some movies and TV shows. So it's all set, it's totally charged, and this baby is gonna be a lifesaver. Um, we've also used like um, our old like iPhones, like we'll have like an old iPhone floating around usually, and so like we've used that. Um, and we've tried the, um, the like pop sockets to like mount it for her, um, but she really likes to just hold it, so I'm just gonna bring the iPad this time and uh, she can hold it, she'll really like that. So we got some D Daniel Tiger on there. I mean, everyone likes Daniel Tiger, am I right? Um, so that's all ready to go. Um, and then I have a notebook and pen because you know toddlers, they just um, like to color. And I was like thinking about getting those like color wonder things, but I just never got around to doing it. But And then I got this little um, magnet doodle, it's just from the dollar store. Um, but that'll be like um, fun for her to color on. And then um, I have, these are more for like babies, so um, some like teething type toys. And then I'm gonna bring some um, of these type of toys that hang like on the car seat. Um, so hopefully this will kind of entertain my um, nine month old a little bit and I can switch them out. Um, so I have a couple different ones of those. And then of course, you have to bring some books. So I brought all of the like, kind of like smaller books. And this book is like really super like detailed and stuff. So I grabbed this one cause I figured this one would, you know, kind of entertain for a little bit longer. Um, so yeah, books of course. And we'll just give them like one book at a time and kind of like space them out, you know, so they don't get tired of them all. Um, and then let's see what else in here. I feel like the rest is just snacks. You guys, snacks are like, I feel like it's like you have the movies and you have the snacks. If you have the movies and the snacks, you're gonna be good. Um, so those are my like most important items. But anyway, I'll show you the snacks that I have. Um, I have a few of these, oop. Hi, Eden. I have a few of these like uh, little packs of raisins. They're more expensive to buy them this way, but totally worth it for the convenience. Um, I have some of these applesauce, like baby food pouches. Um, so yeah, I don't normally buy these, so these will be like a good treat. Actually for my like toddler, my, um, my nine month old won't even eat them. She likes real food. Um, and then I got like some of these 
fruit snacks from um, Target. Um, I have brought like a ton of those because those are actually really good. I like to eat them. And then I have one of these like rice things, like rice baby, rice rusks. My daughter loves those a lot. And if you have been following my channel for a while, you know that. I talk about them all the time. <laughs> She's like obsessed with them. So I got those. You guys, I seriously have so many snacks. Um, puffs, of course. And these like will probably just be more for like at restaurants or like when I can like feed them to her. I have tried those like, um, you know those like cups that are supposed to be like spill proof. They have like the flaps. And so they have to like push their hand in, pull them out. They do not help. Like they they just end up getting like flung everywhere so like for things like this I'm just gonna use these for like at restaurants and stuff but um I'm not gonna give them like a whole bowl of anything and then um I got these um like snap pea crisp they're the Aldi brand um I don't know why I just decided to try these instead of the veggie straws they like these just the same because I kind of like these better but anyway so yeah those are super um easy I can just hand them back there easily okay if the camera looks a little bit off now um my memory card died and i had to readjust it so anyway and these are more for like a toddler snack they're banana chips and i love these too so that's all the snacks that i have in here i'm also going to pack like a cooler with some um cheese sticks some juice boxes um and then i'll obviously have like their sippy cups with water um some other things um to include are like my daughter has like a special blankie so obviously we're gonna have that we're gonna have her pacifier oh, yes she still has a pacifier um and then like she has like a special puppy basically all the things that you know are like her comfort things we're obviously gonna take those um <gasps> say hello say hello so yeah, I think that's it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this and if you're going on a long road trip with a baby or a toddler or both, good luck to you. Make sure just to stay positive. Like, I feel like a lot of people are like afraid of it and they think that they can't do it. Guys, you can do it and you can make it fun too. Yeah, at some points, both of them are gonna be crying and screaming and it's gonna be really, really stressful, but like, it's fine. Keep a good attitude about it um bring your movies bring your snacks and it's gonna be okay right it's gonna be okay it's worth it it's worth it to get out and like see people and experience new things it's totally worth it don't just stay home and do nothing because you're scared of your babies not cooperating it'll be just fine i promise you anyway i hope this was helpful for you guys i hope you have a good day give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it now i'm gonna go finish packing bye guys